In this video, I'm going to solve every moral and all morality on the planet to the glory of the great I am. Moral, A, M, and then the I differs from O by 6, the R and the L both divide by 6. Done. So, God's great name, I am. This is so beautiful in moral. Okay? The A, M equal. The I goes up 6 points to the O. The L is double 6. Then the R is triple 6. So, flawlessly from I am to moral, you went up 6, double 6, triple 6, for a grand total of 36, 6 times 6 for the glory of the Trinity, bam. So the great I am, who is Jesus Christ and God the Father and the Holy Ghost, they own the word moral. And so, who do we go to? Whose words do we go to, to understand what is right and wrong? Jesus Christ, God the Father, the Holy Ghost, the red letters of the Bible, everything that they've said, okay? So, um, that's an awesome gem. Huge, massive. And then morality gets even better because now you add an I in there. You can spell I am verbatim. Uh, but iti is a famous ending that equals love. <laughs> Moral iti. Add 54, which equals love. And also divides by 6. 6 times 9, no less. So the whole thing is really obvious at who owns the word morality and moral. Um, Jesus Christ, the great I am, okay, who declared that he is the I am, and I've been, it's just been, it's a floodgate, it, it's, it's a flood, it's so abundant, it's overwhelming. So there you go, I wanted to preach on that, and the word superhero. Uh, super is I am the I am, and then hero is double I am. So superhero is just, there, it's been solved. Hero is double I am, inside out, H-O-E-R, super ends in I am and starts with the I am. So superhero, I am the I am. I am, I am. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, Jesus Christ, the ultimate superhero, okay. And then if you want to consider yourself a superhero today, you need to follow Jesus Christ. Because he's the king, he's the one that you need to please. If you fail to please the king, you die. And you are what we call a fool. <laughs> Because there is a king. There are three kings, in fact. God the Father, Jesus Christ the Son, and the Holy Ghost. And those people that live to promote their names and what they have said uh, are wise. And people that do not are foolish. <laughs> okay? You know this well enough from life. There are authorities. There are kings. If you do not please the king, you might die. <laughs> okay, so, um, no, it is very serious. Read all the words of um, Jesus Christ. And, uh, but, um, and then the word scare actually came to me the other day. Someone said once, read the Bible, it'll scare the hell out of you. That is actually very true. But the word scare is flawlessly 23-23. I am, I am. Okay, so the foundation of any relationship is respect. That word starts and ends with I am. And um, so you need to respect God. You need to respect Jesus Christ. You need to uh, revere and come trembling to this triune God and beg for mercy and forgiveness. And uh, once you lay that incredible foundation of reverent respect for God, then it's... Uh, you can go in your relationship with them and hear their personal voice and learn more as much as you want. And God is love, okay? But uh, you think about how great he is um, and how worthy of respect he is. Um, so we all need to ask him for forgiveness. Confess the Lordship of Jesus Christ. That's how you're saved. Um, okay, so superhero, we talk about that. I am the I am. And then um, more gems. Okay, I'm just going to keep blabbing them as they come.